Hey, this is Sarah with Precision Camera and Video in Austin, Texas. Today we're down at the 2nd Street District and I have the brand new Olympus EPL9. Now this isn't just any old pen camera, this is the limited edition blue camera. We're going to test it out. So this camera has a 16 megapixel sensor. It comes equipped with the TruePic 8 processor. So even though this is the old sensor that we find in the EPL8, it's the brand new processor that's gonna handle low light quite a bit better. It's the same processor that we find in the EM1 Mark II and the EM10 Mark III. This camera also has 121 autofocus points, so it's quite a jump up from the previous model. But the most important thing about this camera is this wonderfully blue leatherette this design, this is really all about aesthetics. This camera can shoot up to eight and a half frames per second. The raw buffer maxes out at about 14 or 13 frames per second, depending on how quickly you're shooting these frames. But the JPEG buffer is unlimited. The ISO range is expandable from 100 all the way up to 25,600, although this is expanded. The camera contains a three axis image stabilizer in the body, which is pretty awesome. I'm surprised it's not a five axis stabilizer just because we see that in every single other model in the Olympus lineup and plenty of other manufacturers as well. It still is gonna make a huge difference if you're doing anything handheld low light or any handheld video. To that point, this camera does 4K video up to 30 frames per second and can do up to 60 frames per second in full HD. So not only does this come with a flip out screen that is a touch screen that touch autofocus and touch to shoot, but it also completely flips the other way and becomes very selfie friendly. One thing that I think Olympus does really, really well in all of their cameras are the art modes. Some can be a little over the top depending on the situation you're in, but a lot of them actually render really great effects and color depending on the scene you're in. So like for this, this dramatic lighting in downtown Austin, I'm really loving this like grainy black and white. I can cycle through all of these different artistic modes and see what the picture is gonna be before I take it. This camera does 4K at 30 frames per second and does 60 frames per second in full HD. As I mentioned, this does have in-camera stabilization. It's three axis, not five axis, but it still makes a huge difference, especially if you're filming with this camera. In addition to 4K and Full HD, this camera also does in-camera rendered slow motion. So we've adventured away from the Second Street District just a little bit. We're on the South Congress Bridge because one of the things I wanted to try with this camera isn't exactly a new feature, but it is one of my favorite features in all of the Olympus cameras, even from their TG point and shoot underwater cameras all the way up to their flagship EM1s. The EPL9 has live composite. It'll build a long exposure. It's really aimed at something that's gonna be quite a few minutes long. It's ideal for star trails, time lapse, all sorts of things. What's really cool though, is that it bakes the final image in camera for you. So you can watch the process as it happens. You can watch the stars go across the sky. In this case, I'm gonna watch all of the car's lights go down South Congress Avenue. So we're gonna try it out.
In addition to creative features like live composite, this camera also allows for a handful of other creative features, such as multiple exposure mode. The denim version of the EPL9 is the perfect companion camera. Its size is ideal for the individual who wants a large improvement over their phone for lifestyle photos and video, and packs a punch with great features even enthusiasts and professionals will enjoy. Small, fast, and full of creative features, everyone will love making photos with this compact machine and look good doing it too. Thanks for joining us on this adventure in downtown Austin. Come by the store and check out the camera for yourself.